as we all know, when we have a whole number exponent such as 2 to the 3rd power, this means 2 times 2 times 2, which is 8. And when we have negative exponent such as 2 to the negative 3 power, we just do 1 over 2 to the 3rd power, which is 1 over 8. And if you have a rational exponent, let's say 1 over 3 for the exponent, this means the third root of 2, right? Namely the cube root of 2. And then you can do some approximation to handle that. But have you ever wondered what is going on right here if the exponent is irrational? So let's take a look of what's 2 raised to the square root of 2 power. Yes, an irrational number for the exponent. Especially we have proved that square root of 2 is irrational. Huh, how can we handle this at all, huh? Interesting. And now let's see. Well, well, this is how we are going to handle it. First of all, this right here, we know square root of 2 is about 1.4142 and so on, so on, so on. What we are going to do is, we will define this as the limit as n goes to infinity. 2 stays the same for the base, but we will be looking at 2 raised to some power. And let me just put on rn right here. And I'll write this down for you guys. Where rn is a sequence of rational numbers such that the limit as n goes to infinity of rn, this right here, gives you square root of 2. And hopefully, you guys have seen my other videos on how to approximate square root of 2. I showed you guys how to use the Newton's method and you know, other methods as well, so be sure you guys go check that out. So, we are going to compute it and let's see what will happen. So, first of all, I will have to put down a note right here. So, note. As I said, square root of 2, based on the previous computation that we did, this is a approximately 1.4142 and so on, so on, so on, right? So what we can do is we can take Rn to be this. So uh, I should put down like a semicolon like this. We can take Rn to be like this. Remember, Rn has to be a sequence of rational numbers. So let's do this. The first number in you know, the sequence, I would just say this is going to be 1. Next number, 1.4. Next number, 1.41. Next number, 1.414. Next number, 1.4142. Next number, well, you have to watch my other video to see what the next number is. So this right here is pretty much my, uh, the sequence of Rn. And notice Rn does approach square root of 2. Okay, if you just follow along this right here. So, to make sense of this, we are going to do some computation right here. I will have to first look at what is 2 to the first power, and of course, that's just equal to 2. That's so nice. Now, I will look at 2 raised to the 1.4 power. And you might be wondering, how can we handle decimal numbers for the power? Well, don't worry. 1.4 is the same as 14 over 10. So let's put this down as 2 raised to the 14 over 10. And of course, you can reduce the fraction. This is the same as saying 7 over 5. Well, how can we handle rational exponent? This right here is the same as saying the fifth root of 2 to the seventh power like that. And you can use Newton's method to get some nice approximations, but I just want to tell you guys that this could be done. And I will just tell you guys this is approximately 2.6. 3902, like that. Yes, I'm looking at the answer over there. Okay. Anyway, next, I will just tell you guys we are going to do 2 raised to the 1.41 power. And leave a comment down below if you guys want me to do some Newton's method for this one right here for you guys. But seriously, the other ones just, you know, I will just tell you guys what the answer is. Anyway, 1.414 for the power right here. This is going to be approximately uh, 2. Point 65707, 737, sorry, and then next one, 2 raised to the 1.414 power, which is um, at this stage, and just, you know, work this out, you get approximately 2.66475. And then, let's do one more right here, you guys can still see right here, huh? 1.4142, this right here, give us approximately 2.66512. And of course, you have to just uh, you know, keep this going on forever. Like this, da, da, da. 
right? So what we are trying to do is what we what we say is that uh, two raised to the square root power square root two power. This is the limit as n goes to infinity of two to the r n power. So you can look at this as a sequence as well. You can look at it goes from two to two point six three nine zero two, and then to this, to this, to that. This right here does converge, okay? So if this right here does converge, you will see that this is actually approximately, let me just put down, 2 square root of 2 power is approximately 2.66514, like that, right? So this is how you handle irrational exponent. And in my humble personal opinion, I've, I know, I think you guys can agree with me too, it's like, uh, yeah, I don't really like this definition because there's something called the calculator. Because to calculate this, it's a lot of work already. And imagine you have to calculate, um, uh, like a sequence of a bunch of these numbers to get that. That's a lot of work. Yeah, but you know, this is the definition. I think it's still kind of cool, even though. Uh, yes, I will personally use a calculator as well. But anyway, this is the mathematical definition. Let me know in a comment down below if you like it or not. And be sure to subscribe uh, for more math-related content. Thank you guys so much. And as always, this right here is it.